This medication is used to treat constipation by increasing the bulk in your stool, which helps to cause movement of the intestines. It also works by increasing the amount of water in the stool, making it softer and easier to pass. Psyllium, one type of bulk-forming laxative, has also been used along with a proper diet to treat high cholesterol. The daily dosage for adults is 1 to 2 heaping teaspoons mixed with at least 8 ounces of liquid, taken 1 to 3 times daily. It is best to take this medication with a meal or at least 1 hour after or before a meal. When taking consul, sugar, 3.4 gram slash 11 gram oral powder, it's important to follow the directions provided by your doctor or on the product package. To prevent choking, make sure to take it with a full glass of water or another liquid. If you're using the powder form, be sure to measure each dose according to the label, mix it with a full glass of liquid, and drink it right away. You can add more liquid to the mixture if it becomes too thick. The dosage of this medication is based on your age, medical condition, and how you respond to treatment. It's important not to increase your dose or take it more often than directed. Also, be aware that this product may decrease the absorption of other medications, so be sure to take it at least two hours apart from your other medications. It may take one to three days before you start to see the effects of this medication, so it's important to use it regularly to get the most benefit. Try to take it at the same time each day to help you remember. And remember not to take this medication for more than seven days unless directed by your doctor. If your condition lasts or gets worse, or if you experience bleeding from the rectum, be sure to contact your doctor. And if you think you may have a serious medical problem, seek medical help right away. Gas or stomach cramping may occur when using consul oral powder. If any of these effects last or get worse, it is important to inform your doctor or pharmacist promptly. If your doctor has recommended this product to you, it's because they have determined that the benefits outweigh the risk of side effects. Many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. When taking this product, it is important to drink at least a full glass of water or other liquid, 8 ounces slash 240 milliliters, to prevent it from swelling in the throat and causing choking. Seek medical help immediately if you experience symptoms of choking such as chest pain, vomiting, difficulty swallowing or breathing after taking this product. While a serious allergic reaction to this drug is rare, it's important to seek medical help right away if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction, including rash, itching slash swelling, especially of the face slash tongue slash throat, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you notice any other effects not listed, it is recommended to contact your doctor or pharmacist. In the U.S., you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects or report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov medwatch. In Canada, you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects or report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before taking this bulk-forming laxative, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies. This product may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions or other problems, so it's important to talk to your pharmacist for more details. Before using this medication, it's crucial to inform your doctor or pharmacist about your medical history, especially if you have stomach-slash-intestinal blockage, difficulty swallowing, appendicitis, symptoms of appendicitis, a sudden change in bowel habits that lasts for longer than two weeks, or bleeding from the rectum. If you are planning to have surgery, it's important to let your doctor or dentist know about all the products you use, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. Some products may contain sugar and or aspartame, so if you have diabetes, phenylketonuria, PKU, or any other condition that requires you to limit or avoid these substances in your diet, it's essential to ask your doctor or pharmacist about using this product safely. If you are pregnant, it's important to inform your doctor before using this medication. It is also important to consult your doctor before breastfeeding, as it is unknown if this medication passes into breast milk. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions with consul, sugar, 3.4 gram slash 11 gram oral powder. Certain medications may interact with consul, affecting how they work or increasing the risk of serious side effects. Be sure to keep a list of all the products you use, 
including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Never start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without first consulting your doctor. Always seek their approval before making any changes. If someone has taken too much consul, sugar, 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. In Canada, residents can call a provincial poison control center. It's important to act quickly in these situations to ensure the person gets the help they need. It's important to keep all medical and lab appointments when taking consul, sugar, 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder. In addition to taking this medication, there are lifestyle changes that can help prevent or relieve constipation. These include exercising, drinking enough water, and eating a proper diet with fiber-rich foods such as bran, fresh fruits, and vegetables. It's a good idea to talk to your doctor or pharmacist about any lifestyle changes that might benefit you. Remember, consistency is key when it comes to managing constipation. If you forget to take a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If it's close to the time for your next dose, just skip the missed dose and take the next one at your regular time. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. When it comes to storing Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder, it's important to follow the specific instructions on the product package or ask your pharmacist for guidance. It's crucial to keep all medications out of reach of children and pets. It's important not to flush this medication down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed to do so. When this product expires or is no longer needed, it should be properly discarded. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the best way to dispose of it. And that's it for storage and disposal. Now, let's talk about the uses and benefits of Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder. The recommended dosage for adults is 1 teaspoon of Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder, mixed with at least 8 ounces of water or juice, up to 3 times daily. It's best to take this medication with a full glass of liquid. And it's important to drink plenty of water while using this product to prevent it from hardening in the throat. Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder is commonly used to relieve occasional constipation and to maintain regularity. It can also be used to help with diarrhea, irritable bowel syndrome, and hemorrhoids. The optimal timing for taking this medication is either in the morning or evening, depending on your regular bowel habits. It's important to establish a routine for taking Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder to ensure its effectiveness. That's all for the uses and dosages of Consul 3.4 gram 11 gram oral powder. I hope this information was helpful to you. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.